So with this empty project, you can now see the structure of the brand new media pool. It is a double-paned media pool, although I can actually hide the bin list by clicking this button down here in the corner, which allows me to see all of the bins inside of this project. Now, let's say I wanted to do some synchronization. I've got dual source audio and video recorded separately, and I wanna go ahead and sync those dailies here. So the first thing I wanna do is to import the media and keep it organized. So inside of the default master bin, I can right click, choose add bin. It gets added hierarchically to the list. Everything's inside the master bin. It doesn't look like it because all the other folders aren't indented, but in fact, every other bin is inside of the master bin. And I'm gonna name this Basin. Now here's the trick when you're creating new bins and you wanna make sure you know where they're going. Whichever bin is currently selected is where new bins are going to be placed inside of. So with Basin selected, if I just right click and choose Add Bin, you can see that bin is placed inside of the base scene bin. I'm gonna call this video. If I want to place another bin inside of base scene alongside the video bin, I must first select base scene, then right click, add bin, and add my audio bin. So with this done, I can import media the same as you did before. I'm gonna select this video bin, and I'm going to select date scene video. I'm gonna right click it and choose add folder into media pool. I now have this incredibly convenient pop-up that comes up whenever I'm adding media to the current project that doesn't match the current project settings before you would unfortunately reconform the media to fit the project settings which if it's not what you want would generally give you a very bad result now you're automatically flagged that the selected clips are different in terms of the frame size and the frame rate and you have the ability to with one button click update the project settings to match the new media so you're never going to have media that's mismatched ever again that's fantastic